Holy! Can I can I watch that again? Actually, watch that again. The perfect taken on the top side. Finally getting the pushback. Okay. Actually, he didn't. He didn't. He didn't. I'm gonna I'm gonna explain to you guys how a Kali ulti works real fast. This is a pretty important thing to know as a, as anyone anyone playing as a Kali, you need to know this. The way a Kali ulti works, it's a dash, right? It's a it's all it's a really fast dash, and it goes from point A to point B. So when you press R2, the the really fast one. It takes a screenshot of everything that is in that path and does damage to it, no matter what. So, for example, if if you flash before Akali reaches you with R two, like you you try to you know react flash or R two, you will be hit by the damage. It's a screenshot. The second she presses the button, everything in that everything in that line will take the damage, no matter what. So you can watch here. It, it's not the best example, honestly, but no matter what happens here, any stun, any knockup, whatever, the fact that he pressed the button, he, he will take the damage. No, no, not if they're targeting but like, obviously, the whole point of it is that you can't react to R Akali's R2 with dashes, flashes, or any sort of, like, movement ability, because... That's it. It is like completely counterintuitive to the way that the ability looks. The ability looks like you're dashing through and hitting everyone in. It's not how it's coded at all. Barely holding on. You have to predict it. That's such a big pick for Carmine Corp. They get the kill on top side. Upset's going to get the mid lane terror as well. I mean, might get this terror just before Oscar Erden comes in. Good bubble from the tower. Now Oscar's in no man's land.